In the previous video, we talked about the importance of testing your code to make sure that it works as we expected. However, in a data science project, there is more than just code, there is data. Since our code assumes certain properties of input data and output data, such as its features, whether it has no values, etc. It is important to test your input and output data to make sure they match our expectation. There are several ways to test your data, but the easiest way is to use Pandera. In this video, you're going to learn how to test your Pandas data frame with Pandera. To install Pandera, type pip install Pandera. To learn how Pandera works, let's start with an easy example. Imagine your data looks similar to this. In this data, we have three columns, name of the fruit, the store, and its price. Your manager told you that there should only be apple, banana, and orange in your data, and the store should be only the nearby stores, which is Audi and Walmart. And the price also cannot exceed 4. Now, this is only a small data set, but imagine you have 1000 rows of this. It's very time consuming to manually look in at every single row. We can use Pandera to make testing easier. So to use Pandera, start with importing Pandera as PA. We will also import column and check. And let's create a schema that will be used to check our data. To create a schema, we're going to use Pandera data frame schema. Here, I'm going to specify the characteristic of each of my column using a dictionary where the keys is the name of the column and the value is the condition that we want Pandera to check for that particular column. The first argument will be the data type and I want the data type of my name column to be a string and I also want to check if it is in the list of available fruits. Another thing I want to check is whether or the value in the store column is in the nearby stores. Last thing I want to check is whether all the values in the price column is less than 4. So I'll use check less than 4 for that. Okay, so now we already built a schema. Let's use it to validate our data using schema doc validate and the data object. So looking at the error, we can see that we have a schema error and the error is check less than four. From this error, we know that there is one failure case and it is at index three. Now we can scroll up to our data and we can see that at index three, the price is four, which is not less than four. We can see that the output is very straightforward and easy to understand. Now, if we fix it to less than five, we should not get an error anymore. And we will just get a pandas data frame back. Pandera provides a lot of other checks. To see all the checks available, go to Pandera documentation. You will see some common checks such as equal equal to greater than greater than or equal string contains is ings etc you can also have more than one check per column by using a list for example if i want to check that the price is less than five and greater than zero i can add check greater than four to the list of checks like that if the check that you want to use is not among the built-in checks that Pandera provides, you can create a custom one using Lambda. For example, we can use a custom check to measure the sum of all the values in the price column is less than 20. So we have just created a custom check with very intuitive syntax.